How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to the Toy Table, and welcome back to the Toy Table Invitational. Yeah, I said yeah. yeah there's my co-host, Ken, and I'm your host, Steve. We got all the cars provided to you here in order for our second annual Blind Bag Invitational, and this is going to be an attempt at the big police chase. Okay, so I did mention off round... Oh, so I want the island. I got the yogurt. Oh, he chugged the yogurt drink. He's powered up. He's ready to go. He's got his fuel. Okay, so we did the the draw and the the points run, and I, I said the, the, the leaders were going to get I up front I for the police chase. Uh, I wish we could do that, but what we've done is we sorted them all into the low numbers, so we're going to try to put the low numbers closer to the front and the high numbers closer uh, to the back. We slightly adjusted the launch ramp okay, so it's not where. Uh, eh, don't do that. So it's nowhere near as steep. So let's us stack our cars. But some of them just don't oh, cooperate. And in the case of that, you're going automatically to the back. Yep, one sec. And even then, in this first round, they might all be randomly put on there. So what's going to happen is you're going to get launched. All 40 contestants are going to be on the ramp with one police car. Any police car that passes a car throughout the length of the track, that participant is going to be out. And then we're going to add a second police car and a third police car and a fourth police car until you guys are all gone. We're going to try to do this about three times today. And we're going to count points along the way for every time. You evade the police, you're going to get 25 points to your score with the finalist, the final guy getting 100 points extra. Uh, one thing to note, any car that makes it to this little, uh, where the pavement ends there, they're automatically going to go to the next round because uh, in some of the test runs, you know, I'd be running them and there'd be a police car all bumped in there and... I'm not sure who exactly made it across the line first. Yeah. All right. All right, buddy. Let's get this started here. Let's start stacking them. All right. We did it. Hey, Ken. Watch this, Ken. Here we go. Here are your cars. Take a look at your number. They are in funny order. Other from then one to whatever because they don't all cooperate and stay where they should. So there's going to be a totally random event. Now, one, two, three, uh oh. One, two, three, go. Here we go. Wow. Looks like, unfortunately, only one car got pulled over by the police. And that was. I think brick by bricks, 36 car. Everybody else is going to get 25 points. Part of the rule is the whole police car has to be past the... Has to be past them. Wow. I was hoping more cars were going to be taken out because that's hard to stack them. Yeah. Alright guys, so here you go. Round two of the first one we're doing this. All the cars made it through. Except number 36. So it's another random drawing here. And there's two police cars sitting at the end. Okay, you gonna let go? Yeah. One, two, three, go. Uh oh. Oh, look at the big black traffic jab. There, there's some eliminations there. Greg Neves went under the couch. I don't even know how you got there, but you were under my foot there. Let's just count them. This is mayhem here, Cat. Look at this big wreck. Okay, where are we going to cut it off? I think all these cars are safe from elimination. And all these guys are out. So, number four, you're out. 19's out. 32's out. 27's out of this round. 5's out of this round. 30. The Chevrolet. Dave Aker, zero. Paradox. 
sweater. You had a sweater? No, up here. Okay. Okay, well, we'll get you the sweater. All right, so this is round three, and the field is significantly shorter here. One sec, we see a car getting wedged up as we speak. Oh, no. It's all the silhouette. This is an annoying car for this format. Sorry about that delay. No, uh, just, just to three police cars. You can hang on to that police car, Ken. Yep, just pull it off. Okay, so the notables here. We got Greg Neve still in. We're going to give him a lucky dog. We got Calgary in there. We got uh, stuff and more Hot Wheels. Okay, let's see it go. One, two, three, left. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! This one car just knocked out half the field that's left. Oh no, I see Scorpio's gone. Weapon X Wing's out. Uh, Frugal was three there. Uh, Tire Canadian, you're out for this round. A whole bunch of guys went out. And then, oh, Ken's, you're still in. Stuff and more. Hot Wheels is in. Uh, HW Road Beast is in. Greg Neves. I think this one was near the back of the field. Peg Hut Pit Stop, it made it through. Power Pipes. Okay, we got some contenders still in there. And Thunderground Racing, you just got 25 more points. You're off the schneid. Alright guys, and we are back. This is round four. Here's your car. Here's a look at your cars. We got ten. Uh, oh, that's ten there. That's Thunderground Racing. Ken's here. He thinks your dog, Banjo, needs to go along for this ride when you guys are clearing town out of here. Okay, Stuff and More Hot Wheels, you lost it. 23, you lost it. Uh, Matchbox Man in the 38 car, you're, you're in there. 22's in there. Power Pipes is in there. HW Road Beasts. Calgary, you're in here. Okay, Ken, you ready to watch? Yeah. Okay. One, two, three, go! Oh, that dog really hung everybody up. <laughs> Wow, this number one car ended up right at the edge, and we're down to three cars, guys. That's how quickly this match ends. <laughs> I don't think we'll ever get to a ten-star criminal, but someone's going to be a five-star criminal. I think it's Ken right here. All right, Ken, things changed pretty quickly there. Is that one police car nabbed the whole field. So Ken's got the fifth police car out of the package. And here he comes down into the lanes wearing his Dr. Love shirt. Uh, can you put it in behind one of those police cars? Can you put it in behind one of those police cars? Yeah, you're hurting me. Who's hurting you? Uh, your eye? Your, your eye hurts? Weird. Okay, so who do we got left? We got 38, 33, and 39. I want Skittles. No, you're out of Skittles. Okay, one, two, three. Good luck, guys. You're going to get uh, 100 points for the bonus. And if there's two cars left, then uh, 25 points each. So we got one car. One, two, three, go. Who is going to win, Cash? Oh, oh, they're safe. We got to do that one again. We need six police cars. We get to open up one more police car. We got three five-star criminals. Yes. Well, those are all the guys that got caught. They're on their way to jail. All right, Ken. Those guys, those three racers, they did a pretty good job of staying each, out of each other's way to all get past the line and gain 25 extra points into the points total. But now they've got two... Camaros each in their lane behind them. Let's see whether they can do it. One, two, three, go. Ready, ready, race. Oh, oh looks like bad to the bone. Uh, held them all off. They're going to get three more bonus points each. I think I might need to widen this lane for a little bit more variance. But those police cars couldn't get out of each other's way. 
that bad to the bone, save them all. Okay, so that's 75 points that each of these guys got here at the end so far. Alright, so we still have three racers left. Pink Hunt Pit Stop, uh, Matchbox Hobby Man, and 33. I forget who that is. Okay, now you got seven squad cars behind you. Let's see it go, guys. 25 more points plus maybe a victory is on the line. One, two, three, go. Clean start into the shoot. Uh oh. Hey, there's, we got a winner now. We got a winner, Daddy, number 33. Unfortunately, no, we got a winner and we're done. We got to go to daycare. We're going to do two more of this here. Maybe in the comments below. Give me some suggestions on how I could do this a little better. Yeah, we're going to run this this again because it's a whole lot of fun. It's really tough at the beginning when you got 40 cars all stacked up. Ken's going to try to open up yet another one of these squad cars here. But yeah, 33. John Forbes takes the victory plus all the bonus points. Well, not bonus points, but yeah, you were able to rack up three extra uh, so sets of 25 All right, guys, there you have it. We got John Forbes with the victory. I've got a whole bunch of work to do still on this little project. Uh, I still got to add up all the points after event one. We'll call this event two, since the majority of you all got some points. The only one that did not was number 36, and that is Brick After Brick Toys. And I think he's still at... Nope, he's at 125 still. So, and then our leader after the event one was Weapon X-Wing. But now John Forbes, he's going to be adding quite a few points to his total here. He has, he had 125 after the two uh, uh, opportunities for points. And well, he got 100 there. And another 75 for being in that last three pack. And another thing, so he got 250 points. So, yeah, depending on how wet, uh, how weapon X wing, he was around, but he got knocked out after two rounds. Anyways, guys, so that's a whole lot of fun. One of the things that I'm running into issue is, even though it's not really steep at all, basically just steep enough to get him down the hill, is a, a, when we get, you know, eight and nine cars stacked up upon each other they all buckle up especially with all these narrow hoods that silhouette that green one that one's a tough one anyways ken's gone upstairs for a snack i gotta get up to daycare i gotta go to work i gotta do something else today other than cars but uh i'll probably be back down here it's a pretty rainy day all right guys thanks again and uh keep on watching the toy table and uh I thought I had a closing line, but I don't. Anyways, guys, we'll get all those points and we'll do a big update. Oh, maybe in the same thing, in the update. I did today, or yesterday, got some more goodies in there. And I got some more goodies in there. So we'll do a haul video and points update. Anyways, again, thanks again, guys. Hopefully, like uh, the first ever police chase we did. I'm going to think and watch this over and see what else I can do to make it a little better for you guys. Thanks again for watching.